I just hit it. I don't. I don't see anything. Oh yeah, it's going. You're looking at this because you're wondering about Viking saddlebags. Well, I found them online, and I was really thrilled with the price. Number one, and also this is a 1982 Harley Davidson FX Wide Glide, and the soft tails don't have the shocks on the outside. I was impressed that Viking Banks really took that into consideration. Although they're not made by Harley Davidson, they knew that uh, these Harleys had shocks on the outside, and so they have a cutout for that. And so I ordered the bags, and I was impressed with their durability. They'll retain their shape so well. I was also impressed with the fact that you can lock the bag and uh, store your stuff securely in them. And uh, I had my friend Don install them, and what I'm going to do is have him tell you the process by which he went through to put these bags on here. Well, I was very impressed with the bags when I saw them because they're very streamlined, they're good looking, and uh, when we unpacked them, the good thing about it is everything was there. Uh, we needed only to unpackage it and decide where, how we were going to mount them. And uh, the good part about it is that mounting was quite easy because the holes in the top of the bag match the mounting that they're going to be placed on. And all the hardware fit, and we only had to drill one hole through the bracket. The bracket already had the hole, but it hadn't been drilled through the fender. So we took each bag, we mounted the mounting pieces onto the bag, and then mounted the bags on the fender. And again, as Ron said, the beauty part of it is that the bags are cut away by the shock, so if you needed to take the shock off, you wouldn't have a problem with that. And as it moves up and down, it's not going to get in the way and bang the bag. Uh, the only thing we had as far as a problem uh, was the fact that the little bolts at the bottom of the brackets that go down to secure the bag uh, at the bottom, those bolts were a little bit short. So we had to get so, uh, several new bolts a little bit longer to go through the bag and go through the bracket to secure the bag. But one of the things I saw that I really impressed with most bags uh, they just flop around once they're installed. But these bags are solid. They don't, they don't move at all. And uh, and they look like they're made for the bike. And I think they're just great. Take a look and hone in on the mounting apparatus. You can see how. And uh, Don, just put your hand again on that bag and just show how solid it mounts on there. Yeah. Doesn't move around. It's it's very secure. Yeah, it's a beauty. So I really recommend these bags to you, and think uh, you'll have a, you'll be happy if you if you order them.